main thing that got me interested in nuclear was when I went out to Texas A&M and they have a research reactor out there and they can do something fancy there that's called a pulse and it basically means that they can um, shoot a lot more neutrons and it glows blue and I was like whoa that's the coolest thing ever and explaining the science behind what was going on and I was like yes I want to do that. Um, so even though I fell in love with something that I could just see and touch I could still make visualizations that eventually I'll be able to, to see. Basically why I work here is to develop new methods. So someone comes to us and says I want to solve this problem that we've solved before and we've gotten an answer but it's not very good and we want a better answer. Instead of using the traditional methods we would use, we have to start drawing upon multiple methods and figure out ways to combine them. I think it's exciting because I like bringing in new areas or drawing upon other people's expertise and they bring in a whole different view that you're like oh we never thought of it that way and then you can draw on that and use it in the future. I think I'd be the proudest of being able to develop some code that's basically still in use when I retire or after. Something that's useful to people that they ran some concept idea on it and it went all the way through like the building and then the testing of it afterwards and then like almost through the life cycle of that reactor or that system. I like a challenge so you know it keeps keeps me excited about coming into work every day for sure.